birthday, BB and Mac. I can't believe you guys are 14 years old. Wow, have you grown? Um, BB and Mac were rescued, uh, or their mom and dad, um, Tigger G and Ziggy, if some of you remember, back in 2008. And a few short weeks later, um, BB and Mac were born. Of course, we do not breed here, um, but we have in the past rescued a few cats that have come in pregnant. Um, and um, unfortunately, Tigger G did not know how to care for them, and so we actually had to um, raise them here. Um, and uh, they have done great. Um, I'm not, you know, I have a lot of favorites, but I'm a little impartial because one of our, um, a couple of our supporters named Mac after me, after my last name, McCormack. And so he might be one of my 70 favorites. Um, and he's got a great personality, loves to, loves to stalk. Um, and then B.B. King, he's always kind of been a lazy dude. Um, and just this past, or a few years ago, uh, he got diagnosed with cancer, hemangiosarcoma. And he is actually the first tiger that's ever had IV chemotherapy. And we did it right here on site. Uh, Dr. Kellen did a lot of research and um, we were able to load him up every three weeks and bring him down to the hospital and do his chemo and bring him back. Um, so it, it's quite, quite a significant um, thing for tigers in captivity, in fact. Uh, hopefully we'll be able to, she'll be able to write a paper on it at some point. Uh, that did, the cancer did come back about a year later and so we did have to go in and cut a portion of his tongue off. Uh, but he survived it all and is doing excellent. And recently, most recently, since they are getting older, uh, we moved them down to Rescue Ridge. And it's very quiet down there. You can have a uh, caravan tour, personal tours that go take you behind the scenes and you get to see the hospital where all that went down and, and many other surgeries that we performed and, and tour around Rescue Ridge. So uh, they are loving it down there. And if you're visiting, uh, sign up for a caravan tour so you can get to see BB and Mac. And happy birthday, boys.